Hello viewers, it's your Toronto Whisk it all up here. Thank you for all your support of this new series, Coding for Kids. I've been thinking of continuing it since I heard great feedback from all of you. So, um, as you may know, we might just say this Coding for Kids series is for just a few lines of code for big stuff. And it is. So, and don't forget to click here. I think you can see it here. Yeah, probably here. So to see my new channel, Toronto Escape Gaming. And today I will be coding and automating Gmail messages where you can send thousands and thousands of messages in just a few lines of code and in a few nanoseconds. So let's start. <laughs> So first, we'll start off, what is email? Electronic mail slash, as you may know, email, is a method of exchanging messages between people and true electronic devices. So again, I have a question. And the question is, what is, how, I mean, how does email work? So now we'll see how does email work. The sender, he sends his email into the, his mail server. And that mail goes into the internet. That internet, it travels to their friend's mail server and they can access that email. So basically not that, but it's very interesting, right? So now let's call our trusty friend Robot to the help. So all we have to do is put the email password for ours, the friend's email, and the message you're going to send to him. So now we know what it does and now but right now we're we talking uh robot is just sending messages rapidly so now let's start coding so let's start coding we're on patreon more details will be in the description below so right now the first thing we have to do is put import smsmtp lib which is SMTP library. SMTP stands for Simple Mail Transfer Protocol. Set of rules for email transmission. And yeah, so we'll go on to the second line of code. And I already copied three lines of code. And as you may see, I'll be using Gmail. If you've seen and remember the slideshow that I showed you like two minutes earlier, that we have to send our message to the mail server and that mail server to there. So we have to give information to our mail server to the program. And as you may see, start TT, I mean start TLS stands for transport layer security. Of course you don't want anybody to steal your message, right? So we'll just give it more security and encrypt it. So now we'll be moving on to wait. Yeah. The fourth line of code. I got confused saying it was about the second. So we're back on that line of code. And the next thing that we have to do is put server dot log in brackets. And don't forget to always put quotes. Toronto with kid at email.com so that is our email so it shows that we are sending it net go out put that put another code and then the password so that's a password and that is the end of that code the next thing that we have to do is put server dot send mail codes Toronto with kid at gmail dot com. So that is ours. And now we have to put your friends. So just for checking, I'll be putting myself. 
So that means the same thing. You have to put Toronto Whiskey at gmail.com again. Okay. Gmail.com. So I put that. And the next thing we have to do is put the message, which is another comma, another quote, and the message. So I'll just put, put in ha. So now, all to ending, we have to put server dot close and then double block it. So yeah, let's see how it goes when we run it. So go here, press run. So it's running, it just started. And the process finished with exit code zero. So basically it sent the email. So now we'll be going on to Gmail to see if it actually received it. So now we are on Gmail. And as you can see, we have got the message. And now I'll be saying from torontowhiskey.gmail.com, which is me, I sent it to me again. And I sent hi as I coded it. So basically it works and it's good. So if you want to send multiple emails, all you have to do is copy that line and send it. So now we'll see if you got multiple emails. We'll start off with running it. So it's currently sending. Okay, so it finished and now we'll see you on email and see if we have three. We're back and we have not got it yet. We refreshed our screen and now we'll see how much we'll get. Yup, we have got it. Hello one, hello two, and hello three. So we got it. It is successful. So that is the end of this YouTube video. And it is very interesting to watch this. So remember to subscribe. Don't forget to turn on the notifications bell for more videos of Toronto Whiskid and Toronto Whiskid Gaming. My new channel that I made. So yeah, see you on the next video. Bye.